lucky. He was incredibly lucky to still be on the field. Swung the leg at just the right time. Oh, did he ever. of a lifetime. From the moment the final whistle went, the fans have been out celebrating. For good reason. It was Spain's first ever World Cup final and they won. No surprise then that this crowd plans to enjoy it. The whole Spain is going to get drunk until 8am and tomorrow maybe You know, the first time in our history that we 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 had like such a big moment. Like I cannot I cannot really say with words, but just look at the crowd. That crowd of tens of thousands followed the match on giant screens. It wasn't the swift win they'd expected. There were tense times first. Fears this final would be decided on penalties. And then an explosion of joy as the winning goal went in. They've been dancing in the streets ever since. The Prime Minister's called it an epic win, one that will go down in Spanish history. Madrid's High Street, Gran Vía, was closed to traffic all night for the fans' own victory parade. It's almost five hours now since the match ended, but still the party here in Madrid is in full swing. There are thousands of people out on the street determined to save the moment that their country became world champion. Celebrations show no sign of stopping. Later today, the new world champions arrive back in Madrid. This city, the whole country, plan to welcome their footballers as national heroes. 